Okay, so here's the situation. Quantity supplied is equal to two times the price producers get to keep, minus 20. Suppose we start at a price of 25. Here's what things look like graphically. What we're after is producer surplus, which is for each of these 30 units that they're selling, it's the difference between what they would be willing to take, which is along the supply curve, and the price they actually get, which is 25. So graphically, it's the area of a triangle. So how do you calculate the area of a triangle? One half base times height. So this is one half times the base. The base is how many actually get sold, 30, times the height, which is the gap between what they actually get and the minimum price that they would take, 25 minus 10. So one half times 30, that's 15, times 15, for a grand total of 225. That is producer surplus. Now suppose instead of 25, they actually get 30 for those extra, for those 30 units. So then you're adding on to that triangle an additional rectangle. This also would count as producer surplus. So while well, you're adding on to the 225, the area of the triangle is the area of this rectangle here. 30 minus 25, which is five times 30. So five times 30, which is an additional, what is that, 150? So it would be 225 plus 150 for a grand total of 375. And that is how you calculate producer surplus.